So Thursday is a lazy day for me and I decided to randomly make oatmeal with a whole can of corn. This is super unorthodox, I know. I have some avocado in here and I threw in my almonds. But I was so lazy and I was like, you know what, I'll make, I'll, I'll make oatmeal. Oatmeal is healthy for you. But I think I put too much. This is a lot of fucking food and oatmeal is actually very... Oatmeal can be really hard to take in so this might be something I have to eat over the next... I'll probably end up eating this throughout the night instead of all at once. But, you know, healthy alternative. I can't be eating Hot Pockets all the time even though they're delicious. I'm in the middle of watching Good Time with Robert Pattinson and I, uh, I don't know why this movie is rated pretty decent. I am really bored. Um, I really don't like the soundtrack that they have for this. It's similar to Blade Runner 2049 where it's just kind of loud and obnoxious. It feels that way for me personally and it is distracting from me even being able to enjoy the movie. Um, aside from that, he doesn't play a very good character. Just seeing him make all these poor choices and I guess the story itself, I am just uh, so not pleased. But the thing is, I think I've already spent enough time on it that I should finish it. So I just hope it's almost over. Although I'm pretty sure I must have at least 30 minutes or something. I, uh, oh hi there. So it is Thursday night and Evil Geniuses is about to play. Holy shit, man. Wow, those nails are so long. You're gonna gore someone with this. Holy f Holy shit. Oh my goodness. Oh, holy shit. Okay. <laughs> I really need to clip his nails right after I record this because they're like, like, I don't know. I thought that they were curling for a second. That would be terrible, but yeah, this is way too much. I've been negligent. I've been bad, but yeah, Evil Genius is, is about to play. Um, this tournament is Galaxy Battles. It's taking place in Philippines and unfortunately it was going to be a really exciting event, but now it's kind of just eh, There's only two top teams there right now, so I feel like it's going to be pretty lopsided eh, maybe it'll still be interesting to see them play because I Can watch and I can read during the downtime. So I think that's a nice mix but I already did my exercise for today. I have been consistent. I'm also trying to make sure I don't eat too much fatty junk that way. I'm not exercising as well as I could in terms of time. I should probably try to fit in more time, but maybe during the weekdays, I don't want to push it because I do want time to do other stuff. And you know, after work, it's kind of tiring to try to push yourself. So Milo. Might go hiking if I feel like it just because sometimes I feel like it's nice to go out to the wilderness every week After a annoying week of work um, I feel like it really relaxes me to be out in nature. So it might be necessary Hello <laughs> home for lunch on Friday and Wow rejecting my finger Fry lie. Good girl. Ooh. There you go. I am actually starving. I feel my stomach starting to hurt. <laughs> um, I have not been good with cooking this week, so I am eating Hot Pockets. This upcoming grocery shopping, I really need to be 
precise. I need to make sure that I take the time to really think through and make sure that I bought everything since I've been ordering them. And really want to try to make sure that I have plenty of food for snacks because I'm freaking hungry all the time. I digest really quickly. My metabolism is really high. And then making sure I have good variety for making meals and stuff. <laughs> Yes. Yeah. What? You're leaving me hanging. Good. Good. Hello, it's Friday night, and I finished watching Last Flag Flying with. Steve Carell, Brian Cranston, Lawrence Fishburne, and mm, <laughs> I give it a 3.5 out of 5. Um, there are a couple of moments in the movie where there's a good amount of humor. Uh, Brian Cranston's character is a little bit obnoxious, but he's also assertive and just He's actually likable, even though he's very outspoken. But I think this movie kind of falls in the same category as being about the army and the military. And that topic doesn't interest me very much. So all those aspects of that stuff kind of um, didn't really interest me. Uh, a lot of the storyline that revolved around that, even if minor ones, didn't interest me, so I wasn't really paying attention or didn't feel like I wanted to. So, I mean, I kind of expected that from this movie. I kind of knew ahead of time that I should expect stuff like that, but I don't know. I just wanted to see what it might be like. Um, I actually have quite a busy night today in terms of watching stuff. So this Dota tournament that became a disaster in Philippines, most of the teams there aren't tier one. They're just kind of randoms that I'm unaware of, but there are, let me see. There are like a couple, there's like two tier one teams I'd say, and then maybe a couple tier two that I'm not very familiar with. So the two tier one teams are actually playing each other tonight for some reason, early on in the bracket in the upper bracket, so I would be interested in watching that. It's EG versus OG, and it is going to be on in maybe 10 minutes or so. And then after that, if I have the willpower and energy, I would like to watch Maria Sharapova play at midnight. And I just want to see if she is able to kind of make a good comeback because the match that I watched with her the other day she was incredibly dominant in the first set and then in the second set she was um she was making a lot of unforced errors but she still won um but I guess I kind of want to see if she'll be able to keep up the momentum and place well in the Australian Open so I would I would like to watch her play tonight hello so it is 10 p.m and I am deciding to make myself some eggs because I was looking at what I had. I'm ordering groceries for delivery tomorrow um, during noon. So I wanted to kind of make myself something to eat with what I had left. So I have some eggs and I'm probably going to put an avocado <laughs> to eat with this because I cut half of one for oatmeal and could still eat it with this. I have never had avocado with eggs, but I can't imagine it tasting bad. I'm not sure how weird this is gonna taste, but it is a healthy-ish night snack, so I'm fine with it. Honestly, I eat stuff plain all the time, so I feel like avocado, I've always felt like avocado was like the food version of water. It doesn't have much flavor to me personally, so, Putting it with eggs, I can't really imagine it being a big deal. So this is my snack. Um, I believe EGOG is starting soon, 
they're kind of starting later than they should, but finally I've been kind of bored. I'm waiting for Sharapova's match to start because Dota is this tournament's not really going to be that good because even though it is two tier 1 teams playing each other, one of the teams has like three stand-ins. So I don't feel like it's a very balanced match. Hopefully Sharapova's match will be very exciting because I've been having a kind of uneventful evening and when I say uneventful I mean like not particularly overly enjoyable kind of boring <laughs> so I would like for this to kind of make it a nice ending or something like that <sighs> I'm tired it's 2 30 Sharapova's match ended a couple minutes ago she kind of got stomped on and she had her suspension from tennis and I guess she has been back for less than a year, so it's kind of hard to expect her to be at the top of her game. So she made a lot of mistakes, and it was very clear that her confidence was very low after she got dominated in the first set, 6-1. to one. But now I guess there are still the men to focus on, and honestly, I, I usually prefer men's tennis. It's just that tonight, um, all of their matches are extremely late. Federer is actually playing now after her, but it's 2 a.m. I have to go to sleep. Otherwise, maybe this weekend there'll be some nice matches to watch, although I'm actually not sure if they're taking a break on the weekend. That would seem likely, because that's a lot of tennis otherwise. I'm exhausted, so I have to go to sleep. Good night, guys, and I hope you had an amazing Friday night.